Camtasia's cursor smoothing effect is a great way to add polish to your screen recordings. The effect takes the movement of the cursor in a screen recording and turns it into a smooth line from one point to the next. Let's get started. First, make sure you have a screen recording on the timeline that contains cursor data. Preview your clip and notice when the cursor does not follow a smooth path from one point to the next. Like this sequence, where the cursor takes a few different turns and detours as the form is filled out. The cursor smoothing effect allows us to make this look smooth and natural, eliminating the distracting movement. To apply cursor smoothing, go to the Cursor Effects tab and drag the cursor smoothing effect to your clip on the timeline. Open the effects drawer on the clip to see the cursor smoothing effect. The effect is applied to the entire clip, but it is best to limit it to times in your video when the cursor is moving. To do this, click and drag from the right or left side to adjust the length of the effect. For even more precision, click and drag to move the effect and change where the effect is applied on the clip. To smooth out the cursor at multiple points in a recording, drag the effect to the same clip. Then, adjust its length and position. Let's see how it looks by previewing the video on the canvas. Notice how the cursor now moves smoothly from one point to the next. The cursor smoothing effect can be customized further in the properties panel. First, make sure to select the effect to customize and then edit the settings in the properties panel. Duration refers to the time it takes the cursor to move from one point to the next. Delay controls the length of time the cursor pauses before and after each click. This helps you ensure clicks and movement happen at the correct moment. Use this checkbox to turn easing on or off. Finally, set whether you want Camtasia to detect cursor pauses. This feature allows you to use the cursor to point things out in a screen recording. If the box is checked, Camtasia detects when the cursor is stationary for one second or longer and uses that as a stopping point on the cursor path. If the box is unchecked, the cursor will only stop at points where the cursor clicks something. That's all for this tutorial. Thanks for watching.